स्टूडेंट्स हेयर आई शेयर थर्ड लेक्चर ऑफ दिस वीक मल्टीवेरिएट टेक्निक्स इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर्स आई हैव सेट दैट आई विल एक्सप्लेन हाउ वी कैन कैलकुलेट द मैट्रिक ऑफ द प्रोडक्ट एक्स ट्रांसपोज एक्स एक्सप्लेन इट इफ वी हैव ऑब्जर्वेशन ऑफ डिपेंडेंट वेरिएबल्स वाई वन वाई टू वाई थ्री अप टू वाई एन एंड एक्स वन इज इक्वल टू एक्स वन वन एक्स वन टू अप टू एक्स वन एन एक्स टू इज इक्वल टू एक्स टू एन एक्स टू टू एक्स टू थ्री अप टू एक्स टू एन देन वी हैव टू अपटेन द मैट्रिक ऑफ द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ एक्स ट्रांसपोज एक्स आफ्टर मेकिंग द मल्टीप्लीकेशन सिम्प्लीफिकेशन ऑफ एबव कॉलम्स और वेरिएबल्स we have obtained x transpose x is equal to the first row of this matrix will be n into sum of xi sum of x2 so, uh, sum of x1 into sum of x1 is square sum of x1 x2 sum of x2 sum of x1 x2 sum of x1 into sum of x2 sum of x2 is square in this pattern we can calculate the value of x transpose x then we take inverse of this value x transpose x raised to power minus 1 and x transpose y is equal to sum of y sum of x1 y sum of x2 y here we can easily calculate uh, the values of the parameters beta 1 beta 2 and beta 3 and beta not beta 1 and beta 2 beta head is equal to x transpose x inverse into x transpose y now uh, in this way now we have to take only the inverse of x transpose x raised to power minus 1 and x transpose y you see that the um, all diagonal elements of this matrix are similar so it is not too difficult to take the inverse of this factor x transpose x raised to power minus 1 now i have shared examples of from the book of uh, uh, dr khalid parvez at page number 194 example number 2 of it is example of multivariate regression analysis a single x here the explanatory variable is single that is independent variable x is only one in part the dependent variable which we have to predict was used to predict the two responses variable by the equation which the data is given below x the value of x is equal to 0 1 2 3 4 why x y 1 is equal to x 1 uh, y 1 is equal to 1 4 3 8 9 and y 2 is equal to minus 1 minus 2 2 3 2 now we have to estimate the uh regression lines y1 and y2 here beta is equal to x transpose x inverse x transpose y which were as i have explained earlier in this lectures we can calculate the value of x transpose x in this pattern and x transpose y by using uh, this matrix now down the slides please here it is a x transpose and this is x transpose x x transpose x is equal to 5 10 3 it is a, um, a very easy to calculate the uh, matrix of uh, uh, x transpose i of order 2 cross 2 but which i have explained earlier this will be used for calculating uh, the matrix of x transpose x having order 3 cross 3 as as we have do in uh, last lectures but it is very simple this example the calculation in this example is very simple so here we also see that it is the value of n and it is the sum of x it is the sum of y and it is the sum of i think x into sum of x1 into xy 
Now it is x transpose y taking inverse of x transpose x inverse we have beta head is equal to 1 2 minus 1 1 where 1 and 2 the first column is a regression coefficient of first response of predictive equation and the second column minus 1 1 is the regression coefficient of second predictive uh, response y2 to verify the sum and scares of cross product decompositions find that one also that y transpose y is equal to this Uh, these values can be obtained by using y y trans y y is equal to y1 is equal to this 1 1 1 1 1 and 0 1 2 3 4 taking transpose of this observation y transpose y the, now, now after obtaining the y transpose y we have y head y head is equal to x into beta x into beta this is the observations of x and it is a beta by taking a product of this we have obtained y hat this is the predictive values against each x for y1 and y2 first column is for y1 and second column is for y2 now we can obtain y hat transpose into y by taking the product of um, y hat transpose and y and the residuals is obtained by taking the difference of y minus y head and the e transpose e here i have opt also obtained e e transpose into e e mean uh, residuals the values of the residuals and that it is a difference of observed and expected values of y and it can e transpose into y head this one it will be verified that the e transpose y head should be equal to 0 0 0 matrix it means it is the order of this matrix uh, will be 2 cross 2 and each element of this matrix will be 0 thank you students